The story is everything in the realm of cryptocurrencies. You will profit greatly if you get engaged early in any recently popular narrative endeavor. ERC-404 is a new story in the cryptocurrency industry that is now gaining a lot of interest. It is still in the testing stage. The concept is derived from Pandora, the first ERC-404 token. Unbelievably, Pandora started off at a price of just $250, but today it is worth over $29,000. More than a 12, 500% rise is a significant leap. This tale demonstrates the potential excitement of this new trend. I'll go into great detail regarding the ERC-404 in this video, and we'll also talk about whether you should invest in it. So let us get started right now. Let me first go over the Ethereum Ecosystems Foundation using its two main token standards before talking about ERC-404. ERC-721 and ERC-20. We were first introduced to fungible tokens by ERC-20, which are equivalent digital currency ideal for generating cryptocurrencies. Non-fungible tokens, NFTs, can be created with the help of ERC-721. To better grasp this, imagine that you hold five USDT tokens, all of which are identical to one another. Just same how every money. ERC-20 is hence excellent for generating virtual currencies. However, NFTs are created using ERC-721 tokens. The same is true if you own five NFTs from the Board Ape Yacht Club collection. They are all unique. They may have distinct values in addition to having varied looks. These unusual products have an issue. Due to their individuality and requirement to be purchased by the right person, they are not always simple to sell quickly. A new standard known as ERC-404 was established in order to facilitate the buying and selling of these unique products. The main goal of this novel concept is to make unique digital goods more tradable in order to address the issue of selling them. Allow me to clarify what ERC-404 is now and why the blockchain community is talking about it. Fundamentally, ERC-404 presents the novel idea of semi-fungible tokens, a hybrid that blends the distinctiveness of ERC-404. 721 tokens with the uniformity of ERC-20 tokens. Imagine having a token that has distinct qualities and can function as a standard currency when needed. Let's now examine its operation in more depth. ERC-404 integrates ERC-20 and ERC-721, as I previously stated. Recognize it by example. Suppose you had an idea to employ ERC-404, and you own a rare digital painting that you are unable to sell. The painting can be shared digitally in numerous ways thanks to ERC-404. Here, at is where the magic occurs. These shares are accessible and marketable since they are represented by ERC-20 tokens. Even still, the picture itself continues to exist as a singular, distinct object denoted by an ERC-721 token. Two important features are enabled by this arrangement. In the first place, it makes NFTs more liquid, facilitating the buying and selling of individual sections without requiring a buyer for the full piece. It also democratizes ownership, making it possible for a larger number of people to own and profit from valuable digital assets. A growing number of projects are beginning to use this creative concept as ERC-404 gains traction. This includes initiatives like Defrogs and Pandora, which let more people to participate by allowing anyone to own a tiny portion of digital collectibles or artwork. It allows players to jointly own exclusive things or portions of virtual land in video games, which enhances the fun of the experience. It's not limited to internet content either. Additionally, ERC-404 facilitates the co-ownership of tangible assets, such as homes or other possessions. If you comprehend the idea of ERC-404, kindly click the like and subscribe buttons. 
we can truly use that as motivation to create more excellent videos for you. Now let's talk about the difficulties with ERC-404. First off, as ERC-404 is relatively new, it will require some time and effort to get widespread awareness and be integrated into existing systems. Furthermore, although if ERC-404 seeks to increase accessibility by permitting fractional ownership of items like digital art, true liquidity, that is, the ease with which these fractions may be bought and sold, is difficult to achieve in the beginning. It's time for the last query. Is it necessary for us to invest in the ERC-404 project? Even though ERC-404 projects have a lot of potential to grow, it's crucial to keep in mind that they're still in their infancy and that investing in them carries risks, including as the possibility of losing your money. Therefore, I'd advise you to allocate no more than 5% of your portfolio to this area. In summary, ERC-404 is a novel and experimental token standard that combines ERC-20 and ERC-720 on the Ethereum network. Even though ERC-404 initiatives have a lot of potential to expand, it's vital to keep in mind that they're still in their infancy and that investing in them carries risks, such as the possibility of losing money. I'm hoping you get this idea. All of that for now. Please subscribe to my channel to see the newest videos about cryptocurrency. Thanks for watching.